Hey guys, we are going to brunch today. So I'm dressing up a little bit, but before that we have to go to our taxes because it is tax season. But afterwards, we're going to go to my favorite brunch in San Diego. This hair oil is so good. It smells so good. This is from Kaja Beauty. Perfume. So we just did our taxes. It took only 35 minutes. It was so quick. We filed them together because it's our first time being married. So yeah, that was fun. What are you going to get? <laughs> Cheers! So I got the Mediterranean fried rice. It usually comes with lamb, but I got it with short ribs because I like I don't like lamb, I mean. And then this is a tiramisu pancake, which I love and I need to get it like all the time because it's so good. And it comes with a mascarpone cheese and then a side of bacon and some pancakes. <laughs> little update. These days I've been so obsessed with reading Sarah J Maas. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it. Sarah J Maas. Maas. I got so obsessed since last year December and I stumbled upon A Court of Thorns and Roses and I read it on my iPad and I was shook. It really drew me into their fantasy world and I think the characters are still lovable. And ever since I read that book, I have been on a reading binge and so far I am currently on my eighth book. So yes, I have all the Sarah J Maas books and they're so good. I know they're kind of thick, but I read through them so quickly and I cannot stop thinking about the characters and it was so good that I decided to read her next series or I guess the series before that which is the Throne of Glass series and so far I finished one two three and I'm on my fourth book and this is the book that I'm reading next. If you guys read those books text me dm me because I want to talk to you about it. I just love them so much. <laughs> combined with Italian um, spaghetti. 
but it seems to smell really good so I'm really excited and I'm drinking this grape poppy I've been obsessed <laughs> with poppy mm. tastes so good Hello guys, it is a new day, but guess what? You are not going to believe it because everything, it's just so sudden, but it turns out I'm actually having the puppy today. Yeah, I was not ready for this, but basically yesterday while I was filming the vlog, I was told that the breeder that I have been waiting for I couldn't wait for it and I like called them and they said that they have two adorable puppies that are 10 weeks old so uh, yep I told them that I was going to come meet them tomorrow and my husband surprisingly was ready for it too so we're actually gonna get our puppy today right after my husband's finished with his work which is like 5 30 so we'll probably get there around six something so yeah it's gonna be super exciting so i went ahead and bought like a bunch of stuff on amazon but i also went to petco earlier because i needed to buy some more stuff as well like the crate because it wouldn't ship on time and so i'm basically going to use this crate and see which one i like better and i'm just going to return the one that i don't like as much but yes, so I guess let's get started and put together the puppy stuff before the puppy comes. Okay, so first I got the indoor turf dog potty. So I'm going to put this right outside the balcony. This is the collar. And I also got a harness. Super cute and it comes with a leash as well. At the time when I was still in Myanmar, you don't really treat dogs in Myanmar like how you treat in America. Here you treat them like babies, but over there they're dogs. They're basically to guard your house. So things are a little bit different back there. And we didn't even really take dogs on walks. Like that was not a thing. And this one I got because it's highly recommended. It's a snuggle puppy and you can actually feel the heartbeat and it's supposed to reduce the puppy's anxiety. And it also comes with a heat pack, a cinnamon roll toy, hypoallergenic deodorizing wipes. And I also got some toothpaste. Uh, here I got the cherry blossom poop bags and the dispenser set. So I thought it was really cute. It actually smells really good. <laughs> and I also got this little chewy toy because the puppy is going to be teething organic pumpkin freeze-dried treats. These are training treats and these, you hear them jingling, these are actually potty bells. Now, and I also got some hill science diet. These are wet food. I have some dry food coming in but this is basically what the breeder recommended and you know since she's going to be adjusting a lot when she gets here I don't want to change her diet right away so we're going to start off with the recommended one Sustain and Odor Elimination, the enzymatic formula for training Ooh, that's pretty loud a little cushion but it's still not sure yet so we will have to patiently wait for it but i will update you guys when i go get the dog so stay tuned hey guys we finally got our puppy yeah it's like 8 37 right now so i'll probably update you tomorrow because it's been a rough day but we have our sweet
look who is awake. Hello, Nala. You have a good nap? Yeah? Ooh. Ooh, she's so excited. I need to take her potty, actually. If you don't potty, you're gonna make a poopy mistake again. I know. Poopy mistake. Come here, Nala. Good job. Oh my gosh. Good job. Oh, I forgot to give you a treat again. Is that it? Is that all you want? Hello. Look at her. Isn't she just adorable? Ah. I literally just got her last night and she already knows how to say. No. Pray? Good girl. You want to say hi to the viewers? Yeah? Yeah? You want to say hi or you just want to bite the mic? We can't tell. But Nala is saying hi guys. 